After being off limits to swimming for weeks, a beach in Coventry will reopen in time for the weekend. Eyewitness News reporter Eric Halperin joins us from the newsroom with the details that are new at 530. Eric. Stephen Caroline, other Rhode Island beaches that have been closed this year have closed for an average of three days. By the time at Pri Briar Point open, reopens tomorrow, it'll have been closed for, for 15 days. The water on Lake Tyogue looks pretty, and on a hot day at Briar Point Beach, it could be tempting to jump in. But for more than two weeks, that has not been allowed. With these signs posted, the beach was closed for swimming. We have lifeguard spots, no lifeguards. We have a playground, no kids. We have picnic tables, nobody's eating because nobody can swim here. Adrian Paradiso has lived in Coventry for about 10 years. Today, all he could do was come and look out over the water. He says it seems like that's all he can do each summer. It always comes up bacteria infested and they have to kick everybody out of it. And he's not alone in how he feels. Lester Fuller has lived in the area for decades and just brought his dog down today to get outside. I'd love to come down and take a nice dip, but I don't really trust this place. Besides them, the area was pretty much empty today. No one on the beach and just the swan swimming while I was there. But tomorrow, that may not be the case. Late Friday afternoon, the town announced it's reopening the beach, posting on Facebook in part. Four consecutive results spanning the last two weeks have indicated safe levels of bacteria. The state health department considers water safe for swimming with bacteria counts up to 60 parts per milliliter. All recent test results have indicated bacteria levels below the state health department recommendation. It's a beautiful spot. It's a nice beach. It's really the only beach on the lake. And according to the health department's website, Goddard Park State Beach in Warwick and Camp Grovesner Beach in North Kingstown are the only beaches closed right now. Goddard closed today and Camp Grovesner has been closed since yesterday. In the newsroom, I'm Eric Halpern, Eyewitness News.